Hi everybody, what's good? Um, guys, Murray Winter 75 back um, for another video. Guys, this is not a football video. It's nothing to do with football uh, and I'm really, really sorry that I haven't been uploading recently but I'm basically just going to explain the reasons why I've not been uploading recently and just to basically bring you into the fold really. Um, this is a very different kind of video for me today and it's something that is very, very hard to speak about. Um, Basically, I recently was diagnosed with uh, with depression, and it's something that I knew that it, I I've always kind of had an inkling and a feeling that it's been there for a wee while, but unfortunately, just through I don't know, caught ignorance if you want to, just never really wanted to admit that there's something actually wrong. You know, nobody likes to admit that there's things wrong with them, but unfortunately I reached a point and a stage where um, I couldn't kid myself anymore. I could not kid myself anymore and I had to accept that something was extremely wrong. Um, the last couple of months have been really, really difficult for me um, for very personal reasons that I'm not going to go into. Um, but unfortunately I've had a rough kind of couple of years as well. Um... Anybody who knows me knows that I went through I went through cancer with my dad. My dad had liver cancer and unfortunately my dad ended up passing away. Now a short time later my granda passed away and then an even shorter time later than that my mother-in-law who had always been, who would never really been in the best of health unfortunately her illness really took hold and uh, she ended up passing away as well. So I've had a lot of bereavement in a really short space of time and that kind of just coupled with again the, the extremely personal stuff that I've been going through recently um, has not helped at all um, so these are my reasonings why I think that everything has kind of got on top of me and I've really you know bottled things up for so 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 long um, and I got to a stage where I couldn't do it anymore um, I didn't want to moan about it, I didn't want to complain, I was always under the impression, you know what, yeah I've got problems but somebody will always have a, a problem worse than what I will. So it was really really difficult for me to understand um, and it was really difficult for me to kind of accept that, that there was something wrong but I just reached that breaking point where something, you know, just something wasn't clicking and I had to accept that there was something wrong. I've been away, I've spoke to my doctor been prescribed antidepressants and the antidepressants are not <laughs> everybody here's happy pills let me tell you something right now they're not happy put it that way um you know since i've been taking these antidepressants i've had anxiety attacks i've been tired all the time i've my moods have been all over the place i've been in dark moments <sighs> quite a lot to be honest and it's just it's everything on top of everything on top of everything and listen guys there's some there's so many things that kind of go with depression that I think a lot of people don't understand and that is uh, everybody thinks that if you're depressed you're really sad now listen I am not a sad person I'm quite happy I'm quite bubbly as a lot of my friends would say you know I'm the life and soul of a party at times and I enjoy that you know I enjoy that kind of tag that you know I can go and I can laugh my way through a lot of situations but unfortunately um, that hasn't been happening recently, it's been very very forced um, from me really, you know it's been quite forced, you know I didn't want to laugh, I didn't, or if I did laugh you know again it was really forced, I, was, I wasn't happy with what I was doing and you know this is, it's just so different to anything that I've ever experienced in my life, you know I've had feelings at one point you know just being numb, just being absolutely worthless um, I'm going to be really honest here, seeing as I'm doing this, I've had thoughts of hurting myself. You know, I've had real moments of hurting, thinking about hurting myself. You know, I said to a friend um, a couple of weeks ago, um, you know, I says, I saw that this was my exact words. I said, you know, it's okay, I'll just, I'll walk out in front of a car and I'll get a good wee compo claim or something like that, you know. And at the time, I was joking. At that time, I really was, I was joking, but 
the more and more the night went on, I sat down, I started thinking about it. I thought, did I really mean that? Did it, would I do that? Would I, would I do something so stupid? And it just stuck with me the whole night, unfortunately. And it became more and more apparent that it wasn't a joke. It really did. It became more apparent that it wasn't a joke. And that scared me. It really did. And listen, the reason why I'm making this video is, if, is because I'm basically just trying to put my feelings out there, talk about things, because that to me is a, a big thing. But equally on top of that, I just want to tell people, if anybody out there is having these kind of thoughts, they just pain, numb, worthlessness, having thoughts of hurting themselves, go and speak to your doctors. Go to speak to your doctors, get some counselling sorted out, that's what I'm doing. There's no embarrassment attached to depression, there's no embarrassment attached to mental illness, despite what anybody else will say to you. And listen, the one thing that I will say, and it's something that's really, really, to be quite frank, has pissed me off quite a lot. Since I've told people that I've had depression, the big thing that people have kind of said to me is, oh, just man up. And it's, you can't say that to people. You can't say that to people who are struggling with a mental illness. And that to me is, is is just not on. So I mean, if anybody's listen, if if I got a hundred people watching this video, and if one of them or two of them go to the doctor, that to me is a one in my eyes. I'm not doing this for views. Far from it. I'm not doing it for likes. I'm not doing it for anything really related to my channel. I am basically just trying to not doing everything that that's associated with with depression, and just to try to give people that 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 we nudge in the right direction is to say again there is no embarrassment attached to it. Um, you have to believe me when I say that because I was one of the people I was really embarrassed to speak about things. I was really, you know, I, I just thought things couldn't have been any worse. Do you know what I mean? Or how bad would it, things have to be for me to speak? And I found that out, you know, but didn't let it get to, didn't let it get to my level. Do you know what I mean? Um, but no, honestly guys, that's why I'm making this video, it's nothing to even do with the channel, to be honest, it's nothing to do with, with anything, um, anything related to YouTube, but it's just basically getting a voice out there to people who, you know, who might need it. So, please, if you've listened to this video, and if you're feeling like, like, like that, go and speak to the doctor, get yourself sorted out, that's what I'm doing just now. It's a long road, I know it's a long road, it'll be a long road to recovery, but... It's a long road that I'm there. I'm there to, to, to basically to do. I'm there to work. Um, and yeah, that's all I really wanted to say about guys. Listen, if you did like the video, please give it a thumbs up. Subscribe to the channel if you'd like to. If not, please again, just listen to the words that I say. And if, um, you know, as I say, if you're not feeling 110% or if you feel ill in the head, you know, please go to the doctors and get, get sorted out. Um, but just please, you know, just listen to my words, okay? But listen, guys, that's gonna. I'm just going to end the video there. Again, I really do hope that I, my words have been quite clear. As I say, if you like the video, give it a thumbs up. Subscribe to the channel, one minute 75. Um, but please, just that just at that message, you know, if, if in doubt, get it checked out. Okay? Hey right, guys. Speak to you later.